Hey guys, I'm going to be answering some of your questions ahead of my fight on July 15th. So, let's see what you have to say. Um, this one says, what is it that you saw from Emily's fight you think you can take advantage of? Um, I think she dropped her hands a lot, so I'll probably be looking, looking for her chin up and her hands down. Not even a question. I'm square, scared that you may hunt me down. Do you think you could beat Elbrook? Yes. Yo, Barbie, who do you think will win the male kingpin tournament? Um, I think maybe Winderson or Jarvis, probably. How did you improve from your last fight, and did the last fight make you tougher? Um, I think definitely the last fight did make me tougher because I was able to kind of see my own fighting style and learn that I was kind of someone who goes in and likes to bomb, and I maybe didn't train that. But now I've just decided like, well, that's what happens when you got all the adrenaline pumping. So I've trained to, you know, just bomb the entire five rounds, I guess, and, you know, not get tired then. You'll see my improvements in the next fight. This person says you're going to lose to L. Get off your burner. How do you pronounce your name? It's Barbie36. Who's your dream opponent? Mm, I'll probably say like Ronda Rousey because I really looked up to her when I was young. I used to do jiu-jitsu and that, so I think maybe getting in the ring with her and she's in WWE now, so I think there could be potential there after I win Kingpin. Do you believe that you will finish this opponent by knockout? 100%, that's what I'm here to do, that's what I came to do. I'm getting my knockout. Are you looking to KO Emily or at least drop her like your last opponent? I'm looking to drop her and then knock her out. I'll drop her round one, knock her out round two. Do you want to fight Julie or the other Brooke? I mean, the brooks are the same, so I guess I'll go for Julie. What do you eat every day? Um, <laughs> I eat a lot of soup. I eat a lot of soup. I love soup. How does it feel to be an inspiration for all the alt girlies? Oh, thank you. Um, it feels like I don't personally like see myself like that because I guess I live myself every day. Um, but. It's pretty cool and I get like a lot of messages saying that I inspired people to get into fitness or like, you know, do all that stuff. So I, I may, like, thanks guys. Thanks that you guys like me enough to be inspired by me, I guess. <laughs> I'm inspired by you, I guess. <laughs> do you think this fight is easy? No fight is ever easy. Um, but, you know, I've worked hard. I've put the work in and hopefully by the time I get in the ring, it'll be easy in the ring, you know. Um, hope for the best. Prepare for the worst. Do you think your opponents feel intimidated when they face off against you? Um, probably. I mean, I'm six foot tall, not not small. So I think Emily would definitely feel a bit intimidated when she has to go at the face off. <laughs> Are you scared that there's a possibility that Emily beats you? Um, fears for the week. I'm not scared. Thanks for all your questions. I'll see you July 15th um, for my fight on DAZN, free with subscription. See you then.